Hi friends, there are a bunch of hidden Nessie easter eggs in the new firing range that dropped with season 17 of Apex Legends. So I've put together this video to show you exactly where you can find all these Nessie easter eggs. There are 13 Nessies to find in total in the firing range. Let's start with the green ones because they're the easiest and there are 10 of them to find. For the first Nessie easter egg, head out to the central spawn, go to the left spawn, go inside and you'll find a Nessie just in front of the crate on the side. If you head over to it you can interact and pick it up as you can with any of these nessies in this video and i definitely recommend picking them up and i'll mention why at the end of the video Nessie number two, slide on down to where the weapons are. You'll find a Nessie just in front of the weapons rack. I think it will always spawn in front of the red care package weapons, at least it has for me every time. For Nessie number three, head over to the 1v1 pit on the left side of the map. Behind the dueling pit, you'll see a cliffside at the edge of the map, and there'll be a ledge beneath it where you should find a green Nessie beside five cute little mini Watson dolls. Nessie number four, get yourself over to the dropship on the helipad, kind of a bit more central in the firing range towards the back, go inside that dropship and you should find a Nessie sitting on the ledge next to the weapons box. For Nessie number 5, you'll need a legend with movement abilities, someone like a Valkyrie would work well. Go to the trees on the right side of the firing range, this Nessie is quite a tricky one to see, but if you get to the top branch near the middle tree, you'll need to fly up and then spam your click button, but you'll find a Nessie there which you'll be able to grab. Nessie number six is located near the large tower in the center of the map. Head to the building just behind the tower and look underneath the staircase in the dirt on the backside of the building to collect it. Nessie number seven. As you are near the tower, you can head to the top of the tower. There you should find a Nessie next to the foldable chair. For Nessie number 8, go to the southern edge of the range, head towards the big mountain area at the back and you can either choose to climb up the mountain or make a trusty zipline to get up there and next to the flag you can find a Nessie sitting on top of the weapons box. You'll even see a little doggy doll there as well. For Nessie number 9, you'll need to get over to the island off the edge of the firing range. You can use an evac tower or again a zipline could help you out here. Once you're on that little island, look for the bin bags and next to them you'll find a Nessie doll just sitting there. Nessie number 10 is the final green Nessie easter egg to find in the firing range. If you head back towards spawn after leaving that island you were just on, turn left and head to the left side of the firing range. There'll be a ledge you can get up to and if you get up to that ledge you'll then find a Nessie tucked into the corner. So those are the 10 green Nessies that you can find. There are three special coloured Nessies that you can get by completing some challenges. The pink Nessie, you need to get 100 kills in the firing range. You can get them on the same dummy or you can use different dummies. I recommend lowering the body shields of the dummies to make it a bit easier and use a more powerful weapon where you can get easy kills. You could even use a throwing knife if you wanted. Now you can use any teammates as well that you can get with you in the firing range to help you out and you'll just need to get 100 kills combined across all of you. Once you've done this, head to the building where the tower is. It's the one where the zipline leads up to the tower. You should find a railing there. And if you walk along the railing or get up to the railing, you'll find a pink Nessie. So that's the first special colored Nessie. The next one is the gold Nessie. For this one, you'll need to visit all of the points of interest in the firing range. There are eight specific locations. These are the tech tunnel, the pit, the Belfry, the Wolf's Pearl, the Raven's Nest, the Agility Course, the Firing Range and the Training Grounds. You need to make sure the white text pops up each time and from what I understand, if that text doesn't appear then it won't spawn the Nessie. But that's okay if it doesn't, all you need to do is just go to another POI and then go back to the POI you are just at and the white text should then flash up. You can see in this video as I'm visiting all 8 of the points of interest where they're located, but in all honesty it's fairly easy, if you just run up and down the Firing Range range you should be able to visit all the points of interest and by the way you can visit these points of interest in any order you don't have to follow the order i'm visiting them in here after you do visit every point of interest then you need to head on over to the charge tower and charge your ultimate then use your ultimate and finally head back to the center spawn room you'll find the gold nessie at the far back side of the tunnel and that then leaves us with one final nessie easter egg in the firing range for us to find and this is the much coveted blue nessie it took people a while to work this one out, but finally yesterday it was discovered. The trick to spawn the blue Nessie doll is to get a throwing knife and throw it vertically up in the air. It needs to land on a dummy in the middle of the head and deal damage. And once you do this, you then need to get yourself up to the raven's nest which is above the spawn area. 
And up there you'll find a super secret blue Nessie. And there you have it, that's all of the Nessies you can find in the firing range. I should say a big credit to whoever found these ones first. For most of the green ones they're fairly easy so I found them by myself. But for the coloured ones I had to follow an article on them because they're a little bit trickier to get. But now you've watched this video, it should be easy for you. Now before I finish, I hear you ask why would you want to do this? Well, for one, it's just a bit of fun. Nessie's kind of the mascot for Apex Legends, so it's kind of cool that you can find these easter eggs. But the second reason could be that it might eventually give you a badge or some reward for completing this. At the moment it doesn't give you anything specific, so I should say that, but I'm just saying this because potentially at the end of the season, there's a small possibility we might get a reward for doing this. Anyway, good luck on your Nessie hunt, don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll catch Catch you later.